Kamadeka Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined now with Eric Kamadeka, head coach of the track and field team. And Coach, you guys traveled out to the ECACs and have a very strong showing, finishing second on the men's side and fourth on the women's side. Talk a little bit about those competitions up there. Yeah, it was really exciting for us. Um, you know, we just wanted to go up there, get some of our last chances and best performances for the year. Um, you know, next thing you know, we're in contention for a top three spot on both sides. So that was really fun for us. Um, you know, Kilo started the night, the day off with us winning the triple jump. Uh, both men's and women's four by one teams won the the relay races, and it was exciting on both sides. The women almost PR by a whole second. The men team ran really well without Devante, and it kind of just a bright future ahead of us on that side. You talk about it being the last chance efforts to, to qualify for the national championships. Obviously, will be happening this week. You do have two athletes competing up there in Danica and Devante. Talk a little bit about what you're hoping for and expectations as you guys travel to Ohio. And, you know, this is going to be Devante's fourth time out at Nationals and kind of the, the progression that we talked about. First time is always, you know, about the experience. Second time is about All-American. They're in the fourth time trying to chase that title mm -hmm. down. So, you know, that's where Devante's goals are in the one and the two. And for Deacon, Danica, this is her second time out there. So, you know, if we come back with All-American, we'll be very, very happy with that. They both competed in the indoor national championships as well. What does that experience from the indoor translate to the outdoor and what you're hoping for there? Uh, it's, it's very big for them, you know, because it's a very pressure environment and to be able to get that experience early on in the year and to come back during the outdoor season, I think they're going to be ready to handle it. It's tough to compete that long, that well for that long. You're competing all year long. Yeah, absolutely. It is a long, long season. I mean, they get officially started at the end of October and we're carrying it on all the way through Memorial Day. So it's a very long season to be able to be emotionally uh, up for the entire time, Physi the physical demands of it. It's very, very tough, but that's you know what comes important of the rest, the recovery, and everything else with the training programs that we have in place for them. And those programs have been paying off for everybody involved. You guys have brought home some hardware from the Penn Relays. You're competing at the national championships and those finishes in the ECAC were tremendous. Yeah, you know, we're very, very happy with our year overall. You know, obviously we wish we had more people at the national meet, but to look back and see what we did with a pretty much a freshman dominated team, it's very exciting to see what our future holds for us. Well, Coach, we wish you the best of luck in nationals and safe travels up there. And of course, you could watch it live streamed on the NCAA website. Thank you. He's Eric Kamadeka. I'm Joe Wama. This has been the Eric Kamadeka Show.